The cones are out and the whistles are blowing. Yes, it is camp season once again. And our first stop this year is to Carroll High School. But the main attraction this time wasn't the ones dressed in blue and gold. It was the coaching staff from the black and gold. And if you can't tell from my outfit today, don't wear Southern colors to a Grambling event. But head coach Mickey Joseph took today to get well acquainted with his home base in the search of future G-Men. Give me everything. Because in this sport, in this sport, it's not what you can do, it's what you're willing to do. Are you willing to put in the work? Because we can do what we want, but are you willing to do it? At the end of the day, you know, North Louisiana is grandma. I appreciate Mr. Neal and the rest of the people in Monroe reaching out to us and helping us you know, set this event up. And it, because there's a lot of talent in Monroe. Monroe. There's a lot of talent in, in Shreveport. There's a lot of talent just period in North Louisiana. And we want to make sure we put a gate around it. Coach Joseph got the chance to scour local talent, but also said, if you want to represent the G-Men, you have to work like a G-Man. We gotta have a, start to get a relationship with you. That's why it's good when we have camps like this. If the kids want us to recruit them, that they come out and let our coaches put their eyes on them. I got, I got all my full-time coaches out here. So you you want kids to come out who wants to be recruited by grandma so they can put their eyes on them. And now they got an up, up close interview with them. As far as the current roster goes, the coaching staff has revamped it to their liking so far. And their choice of players has a hometown spice added to it. With the transfer report, it was big for us that we went up there and got kids, but the kids that we really targeted was kids from Louisiana that was at other schools to try to get them back home because we thought that was a plus, that they get to come back and play in front of their family. You know, so if you got a kid at Virginia, you know, who comes back home, now he's, he's you know, he's, he's an hour or two hours away and his family can watch him play. So that was a, that was a big thing, is recruit kids that's from Louisiana and get them back home. Covering Grambling State football from Carroll High School, I'm Jeremy Bryant.